Hello guys, welcome back to the part 2 of the NEF codec and Windows Photo Viewer. In this uh, tutorial, I'm going to show you how to activate yourself in Windows 10, the photo, Windows Photo Viewer, that old one you know in the Windows 8, uh, Windows 7, that was simple and efficient. Uh, we are looking for efficiency. I myself, I'm looking for efficiency and uh, why not guys to help you uh, solve your problems. If you don't know uh, and if you have problems with uh, your NAV codec, with your RAW codec, and if uh, the pictures are uh, showing you a couple of seconds to um, launch them, if it takes a couple of seconds to open them, well, it's a problem from a codec. I recommend you to view our previous uh, in our previous week the NAV codec. We have a tutorial there for making you smooth and very fast these transitions and the opening of this so sincerely i don't like this uh photo viewer i i think it's terrible if even if it's new it modifies if you see the colors i don't know exactly why this is happening maybe it's related to my installation of that uh, uh, codec from the previous week before installing that codec guys i could not uh, browse through the photos like I'm browsing now, even with uh, the Windows 10 codec built in inside. You have the second possibility to go in the uh, your Microsoft Store and select from there a raw codec, but I don't think it's that efficient. So, guys, let's activate the Windows uh, because you will not find it if you go at the properties and look for Windows Photo Viewer. So, how can you activate uh, the Windows Photo Viewer? You need to make a text document. First, make a text document and enable from this, enable file name extensions, you see? Enable like I'm enabling here. Open the text document, copy exactly like this from the description, copy the this code, put into the new text document and save it. You need to rename it and delete the extension after the dot and put RAG for registration. Now you can rename new text document, you can put Windows Photo Viewer huh? like this just say yes continue okay and you'll find now in your photos you got to go to properties to change the extension from the photos somewhere here you will find that i uh, have it here because i've been using this one and you will find it guys here on the bottom you click it you view it is that simple is in is that efficient and you'll see even the zooms works smooth works very very fast and yes i have a ssd of samsung is not on the hard drive hard drive could uh, the hard drive could uh, load even more your photos so this is how you can view your photos i think it's uh awesome uh, that i can use the windows photo viewer to the printers it works but uh guys i got to tell you that um, mm, to some printers it makes some problems but it prints it's okay you can uh, use this and i'm delighted to use once again those tools that work very good in the previous versions of windows so this is how you can do it guys and the pictures are loading very fast uh, you got to have a fast ssd also to make yourself this kind of uh, thumbnails fast thumbnails preview so guys hope you like uh, this tutorial hope it helps you thumbs up if it uh, you think it's helpful if not uh, push twice the dislike button and don't forget guys to subscribe the button because we have a lot of free ideas and tutorials thank you for watching have a great day see you guys bye